Hey guys, I am making chicken wings tonight and I'm not going to give you the full recipe for chicken wings because it's basically just baking some chicken wings maybe later on. But I did think it might be useful if I showed you how to cut the chicken wings. I have cut more than my fair share of chicken wings in my life. So I thought that I would show you the best and easiest way to do it, at least that I've found. First things first, gloves. You don't have to wear the gloves, but I just like it because then I don't have to touch the raw chicken flesh because it's kind of nasty. Um, second step is a butcher's knife. If you have the ability to use a butcher knife, definitely do because you need the extra little bit of weight that you can put on this. You can use a chef's knife if you have to, but it's not best because technically at some point you are going to be going through bone. So you want to use a knife that's more actually for that than something that's more for like chopping up vegetables and fish and things like that. So to start off with, there's always three pieces to your chicken wing. There's the drummy, there's the wing part, and then there's the wing tip. Now, some people just cook it as is, like this, and that is perfectly fine if that's how you like your chicken wings. But for me, I never found much value in the wing tip. The amount of meat that's in there is very, very nominal. Um, so I always just cut that off. So what you're looking for is there's little joints in here and you wanna kind of go between the joints. Now this is the part where you're kind of gonna be cutting through some bone. So, I'm sorry, I know this is disgusting, but these are the little joints here. And if you happen to be able to get right behind the joint, that's always the best because then you don't have to go through as much bone. Now you could eat it like that as well, a full wing like that but I like to go ahead and go one step further and cut it a little bit more. So the first thing I do is I cut a little notch in the skin, basically because my knife, with my knife, I'm feeling where the joint is here between the wing and the drum. And then I'm gonna go ahead and cut down through that and get a clean cut there. So that's how you do it. It's, it's actually really simple. It's just a matter of you want to learn how to feel where that little joint is because that's where you're going to want to cut. It's fine if you can't find it and you cut it a little bit one way or the other. It's just that you have to fight a little bit more with it at that point. So you have to go through more bones and you're cutting your wing a little bit short. If you find the joint, you're cutting it at just the right point and there's less bone that you have to go through. So hopefully that was helpful. Have a great night.